Hi everyone, the Lone Wolf here, and uh, as it dawns here on the ticket server, uh, you can see my uh, my brother's been laying some foundations over there, and uh, I've seriously expanded my sugarcane farm. Uh, right now, I have uh, 75 individual sugarcane patches going um, into the uh, energy condenser, so it's starting to come in at a decent pace. Uh, but of course, uh, that's a uh, only some sugar cane and it takes a decent amount of space just to get uh, the 75 patches going so I'm going to expand and uh, the input of the um, energy condenser and you can already see a stone pipe going in there from this gold chest and um, that's what I'm going to show you guys in this video is uh, preparations for the second input for my uh, energy condenser which on the other side over here you can see the piping system that I've prepared for it so um, the idea is to have a quarry at the back here and uh, let's see in this pipe I have uh, tungsten with which I still have to make uh, like an advanced macerator I think in order to be able to do that but I want to keep it uh, copper ore tin ore and gold ore which will then be piped to their uh, macerators so oh, I still have to connect it to that's true and on this side I still have the silver ore, the tin ore, and this is the general filter where everything uh, will go to the left side except for these four which then go to their uh, other pipes and over here everything goes further to the left side and then into that golden chest and then further down into the um, energy condenser. So first thing I'll have to do is connect and the rest of it. So I'll need some cobblestone pipes. Uh, let's see, the gold chest is already connected. And then over here I've got the input for silver. So that goes in this macerator. The input for tin, which will go in this macerator. Input for iron here. Input for copper in there gold straight and then over here I get uh, the tungsten which for now I'm going to um, put down in this chest uh, I'll, I'll increase the production line later so that should be that now I do have a quarry ready but I don't want it all to become a mess just in case I did something wrong so I'm going to test it out uh, with the chest uh, let's see, I'll put down the chest here, and then I'll need a wooden pipe. I'll do it like that. A redstone engine. Oh, and I don't have a redstone source, damn it. You always forget something um, in the end. That's uh, the problem with take it so much to think about. So I'll, I'll probably need some more redstone torches actually because um, I get some extra engines ready for the quarry. So there we go. I'll get that done. That should enable me to get that redstone engine, uh, give it some power. So here is our testing chests, redstone engine underneath it redstone torch to give it some power and then I'll need some stone transport pipes will do I think not that it matters but stone and stone so that should become basically the quarry um, and I'm going to start out with one gold one of these one of these yeah at least it's already starting to take everything and I'll, I'll put some of these in between. There we go. Let's see if it works out. So the gold should take a right here. The copper should, I think, also take a right. The dirt should take a left. So that's going to be like all the other stuff. There we go. The gold takes a right. And copper and you should go left, I hope. Everything else goes left. Yeah, that's good. Looking good, looking good. That looks like silver, which should also take a left. Normally. 
silver takes a left and over here gold should be pipe the yellow one I think yep and this one should probably be the green one for the copper or is it uh, ah, no, looks like it's the the red one yeah that's true it's this iron that's going to have to go uh, on the left side and over here this tin should go in the yellow one or no looks like it's gonna go in the red one tin ah that's the silver one yeah okay and the tin goes in there so like that looks okay right the iron goes in here and then the uh, tungsten goes down there into the chest looks like it's okay I'm gonna test it out with the rest of my stuff that um, doesn't really have any use so all of that starts to go in there let's just mm, I want maybe to add one redstone but that's not gonna be useful uh, yep yeah, all right it's gonna take some time for all this stuff to pipe uh, but it looks okay do I have any tin left in there or not because that's the one that I haven't seen really go in the right direction but um, we can check it on the on the inside I think by now uh, let's see if that dirt is still underway or not anything underway here anything in there no ah damn yeah of course I can't really go uh, through it in the same way but uh, here comes some stuff so that's just that stone and on this side here comes that should be the silver looking good you know it looks all right so here silver goes in there tin goes in there iron will end up in there here comes the gold so that one worked out very nicely and copper so yeah all right uh, i do still need to expand on the power supply of some of these a little bit but right here you can see uh, that should be iron dust that comes in here let's have a look yep iron dust a okay guys this this looks like it's gonna work out and uh, let's see how far in the meantime as you can see my uh, sugar cane stuff is producing quite nicely oh and then the one thing of course that I is anything still coming no and then all that stuff ends up in here making me for now some diamonds <coughs> So let's get back up over here and see how much of this stuff is left. Quite a lot actually. So yeah, that gives it a better view. All the tin goes in the yellow pipe. It's correct. Here you can still see the iron being piped uh, through there. My industrial facility is starting to take shape. So next step, I'm gonna put up a quarry here. Um, I'll see how that works out in another video. See you guys next time.